Hey folks, it's Rithgar here, how you doing? Welcome back to Ark Survival Evolved. We've had a nice little break. I think we're safe from the dinosaurs for a minute, so let's go back and have another go with them. Ooh. <laughs> I very nearly wandered off the edge there. That, that could have been bad. That could have been really bad. I don't know where my other dinosaur, my, my, I got another dodo somewhere. I think he's wandered right off. Oh. He may not have made it. We'll have to get another one. Let's go in here. See, now it's too bright. Switch it back to that. There. And then you look out there. That's going to be too dark for most of you. I can hear stuff. I can hear things in the distance in the dark. Spooky things. Very scary things. Uh, right. Well, we'll ignore the spooky scary. And I want that one right there. And I want to place you down. So this one, it... Oh, it's now got a mat. It, I'm, I'm sure it never used to have a mat. So I'll put that one... No, I'm going to move that one round. No, I'm not. I'm going to put that one there. Perfect. So, allow, pick up, demolish, access inventory. That's what I want to do. So I can make this one. You uh, you just drop the stuff in and it makes it. So there we've got the cement paste. And there I've got the gunpowder. That's consumable. Drugs. There. That's what I want. Narco berries times five and spoiled meat times one. This makes narcotic. And narcotic is something that we actually want. So I'll put those in there. And I've got some spoiled meats. As... Did I just try to eat that? Spoiled meat there as well. One, two, three. That's as many as I can make. Right. So I've made as many of those as I can make. But then if I look in here. I haven't actually got any spoiled meats in here. I'm going to take the meat back out again. Spoil time, five minutes. Uh, four minutes, three minutes. Right, so we, we do have a spoil time on it. There is a spoil timer on it there. I'm going to take you. We've got a load of timber in here that we're going to want for manufacturing items for our house, which we'll do in a bit. Uh, but first up... I'm going to go into here, and I want to make some more of those. So I've got two spoiled meats right there. Oh, narcotic berries. Didn't I have... Yeah, I did. I knew I had some of these. Right, we want the narcotic berries there. Have we got any more? Nope. So then I go to there, and I put all of those in. I have no more there, but if I look into this one, I've got two spoiled meats right there. Five minutes and five minutes. Uh, tea, like that. Spoiled meat, those have got timers on them as well. So th that only lasts for ten minutes. So you get the spoiled meat, but then they don't last for all that long. Which is a little bit of a shame. Right, E to access inventory, and then I can put those two in there. Like that. I don't know if there's a way to speed up um, how fast you can spoil meat. But if we go to drugs and I go to narcotics there and then I uh, craft all. So there's four of them crafting. So I've now got narcotic consumable right there. It's also giving me some extra stuff. And those down there, I need narcotics and I need stone arrows to make these. Right? So if I take these right here and I take those narcotics there go to crafting I want to make some stone arrows in order to make those I want flint level up is available so I will go and I will level up me which is ooh, what do we go for this time let's go into here and then I want to go actually what else do I want to do I got 32 engrams at the moment I was, yeah, it was the hide stuff I was thinking of making. Hide shirt, pants, gloves, boot, hide hat. A large wooden wall there. Let's take that one. And large storage box. Let's take that one. 
That's something that I'm going to want. I haven't learned a trike saddle. Metal stuff up there. Fur boots. Artifact pedestal. Stone fence foundations. Look at all this cool stuff. Bear traps. Crumbs. This is, this is getting serious now. This is getting very serious. Spy glass and then we can get the magnifying glass. Short range analysis of both flora and fauna. I'm guessing that's going to be a useful thing as well. Uh, wall torch. And we crafted out the smithy. We're going to want a smithy, aren't we? A preserving bin there, that will preserve our meat. But, I mean, the, the rates of gathering that we've got, that's not going to be a, a problem. We don't need to uh, put food for your nearby pets in this and they'll automatically eat it when they get hungry. Seems very handy. I don't know what I'm supposed to get. Let's get nothing. We'll, we'll, we'll just get nothing. We'll, we'll, we'll leave that. We won't worry about it. I need to come out of there. I want to go into this one and... I actually want to take those a second, and then I want to go back to crafting and... Right. Arrow. It's one stone arrow. I want two of them. Because then I want to come down here. Seven stone arrows, seven narcotics. So then I can go craft all. And that's going to give me some of those. Then crafting, and we want the bow right there. I need fiber. Let's have a look. Oops. Take all of them. There. Right, so now we have the fiber. Then I can go back into crafting, and I can go to the bow, and I can make one of those. 15 wood, 50 fiber. And then I can go... Oh, it's still making. Wait for that one to make. I've got a club right there, and I've got that one. So if I, I'll drop that one into there. And I'm going to drop the club down into there as well. So we've got various items. How... Oops. I didn't want to put that one out. Uh, access inventory. That's what I wanted to do. Right. You are doing a wonderful job. Doing all of your cooking. We'll put... All of the timber in there. And then I'll put in some... Right. I don't have any more room for any more of that. I'll take that and that. And that. And then put in another one of that. There we go. Right, we'll take more spoiled meats. There's a 12-minute timer on those. And then I will go here to access the inventory on that one. And we'll drop those in. I've got some berries that I can make. So if I go there and craft those four. They'll keep making. And we can come out this way. So I've now got... Oh, hang on. No, there's another thing that I need to do. I need to go in here, and then I need to drop those onto there. So I've got the bow, and that will shoot narcotic arrows. What is that thing up on the hill? Oh, it's a Bronto. That's a gut big Bronto. Now, these things here, these are good, right? This is a Parasaur. They're good. They are useful. They're, they're one of the early what, the early saddles that you can get as well. But the Carbonimus, the, the type of turtle type things, if I remember correctly, those are definitely the best ones for using for pack mules. So if we really want to be able to carry back a whole load of wood and stuff... Right, I know I've just brightened that up incredibly right there, but I've done that quite deliberately. You're hot, you should find a place to cool down. See, it's really dark, and I'm thinking a medium. I'm, th I'm thinking we want to go medium. If I go to options in here, and I went to keyboard there, and then I changed it down here, gamma value. I changed that to slash and that to hashtag. So let's change this one to, no, the brighter one. We'll change that one to three, like that. Save. And then we'll resume. So let's see. Uh, hashtag. That's actually a bit... I think that... I think three is going to be about right. I want to find a Carbonimus. That's the bad boy that I'm after. We've either got to try clubbing him down with this one. Or we've got to try um, shooting him with the arrows. It's going to be one or the other. Because the idea is that we're supposed to knock him out. We don't want anything else. We want to knock him unconscious. And then we've got to feed him berries until he becomes our friend. So where can we go and feed him some berries? i got to find one first. 
A Carbonimus. Does anybody see a Carbonimus? There was one down here, but there was those numbers that we got on our stuff there. Uh, that's fine. Um, there was a Carbonimus under here, but we killed two raptors down here. I suspect that they went and ate the Carbonimus that was wandering around. More's the pity. Right, now it's getting, like, really bright. The the light shafts coming through, they make this difficult. There's a chest over there. There's a big chest. We've still got that predator down there, swimming around in the water. But if we come down here, that looks like a dilo over on the end. Those are just little small ones, you don't have to worry about them. What did I hear? Was it him? I think it was him. It was a little small dilo dinosaur. Alright, let's go through here. There's a big fish up that way. There's some colacanths under here as well. Let's not worry about those. I want to get out through here. And there is the dilo. I'm going to just take... I'm not going to tame that one. I'm just going to take him down like this. There. See? Really easy. Really quick. And I'm going to harvest him for leather. Like that. 31 hides. And I'm going to go up here. Right. What else do we want? So what's my... Oh, that's the, the bright... Yeah, we want, the, the, we want gamma rating on 2, I think. Even though it's still quite bright. But here, this... These chests, they come down. You see the bright lights, they come down, and then you can go and access. Access inventory, supply crate 90 of 100. <laughs> nice! Look, we got a... There's a, full, there's a full leather armor kit in here. Oh, fantastic. Transfer all. I'll take that. Thank you very much. Uh-oh. Is that predator over there? I'm, I, he's gonna come and get me in a minute, isn't he? He's, he's gonna uh, he's gonna end up coming over to us. What is he going for? Right, let's let's put this new stuff on. Like that. Yeah, you you can get um, dyes for these, and you can put dye on them, and it does look really cool. But that thing is, he's getting too close for comfort. I'm not gonna be able to run away very easily. I'm wondering if we should go for him. I've got armor on. He's actually not interested in us. Look. He's not. He's not actually interested in us. If he was, he would have come and attacked by now. I've no idea what that thing is. I'm going to leave him be. I'm, I'm, I'm not going to interfere with him. If he's, if he's not going to bother us, then we won't bother him. I think, that's, I think that a live and let live philosophy is, is called for here. You're cold. You should find some warmth soon. Yeah, I will. Don't worry. Right, let's go up. My O2 bottle right there. It's ticking down. There. O2 is recovered. Right, my O2 is all right at the moment. And... Right, I can go for a parasaur. I think I'm going to... I think that's what we need to do. I think we'll have to go for a parasaur rather than a carbonimus at the moment. So let's take the bow and one trank arrow. We're about to use these. Right. There. Have I killed him? No, he's just... Un oh, ideal. Right, he's unconscious. Okay. Um, I go to that one. Right, so now we access uh, access inventory. Like this, and then all I gotta do is I gotta drop some berries in. Right, and then taming 41%, they start eating, and what they do is, is as they get hungry, they eat a berry and then they get tamed. Because I've got taming times eight, uh, eight times speed, um, every time they eat a berry, it goes really, really quickly. Right there, so I've, I've instantly done it. It's, it's like really, really fast to do the naming and everything. So this is my third one, which means that you are going to be called a Windwalker, like that. 
And then we're going to... Well, I've got my own level up, but um, equip, saddle, ride, access, inventory, right there. So, got some berries on you right there, and I'm going to put some more berries on you as well. So, your weight, you can carry 480 for me. That's fantastic. I'm going to keep you carrying weight. That's, that's going to be useful for you. Uh, saddle, cost... Can I put these on... No. I did used to have a thing where you could put glasses on the dinosaur and it looked really cool. And equip saddle to ride. So I can't actually do anything at the moment, but they're, they're following me. Let's first go in here. So I've got my health, uh, food and water. We'll, we'll boost both of those. I won't take any more engrams for a minute. Uh, water is max. But what I will do a second is if I run down to the water's edge, I will just fill that water skin again. There. And that little dinosaur there is going to follow us along. It's going to start making things. So what I can do is I can do this. If, no, no, I want to go there. The only thing you got to be careful of is they don't get too close. Oops. Right. I've now got 100 wood. So you, right over here. So if I go there, uh, behavior... We've got disable following, enable wandering, no. Turret mode, group whistles. Change follow distance from medium. Right, so follow distance is medium at the moment, that's good. Uh, access inventory, so I can go to there, and then I can do things like this. I can, I can drop in all of that meat there. I can drop in a load of the thatch and other things like this. The stone, uh, some of the timber, things like that. And, oh, we can put that in. Transfer those. I'll keep the, I'm going to keep the hides on me just in case something bad happens to my dinosaur. What is that thing then? Does that only eat fish? Is that like a thing that only eats fish? I'm half tempted to go and trank it and see what it does. Hey! No, you don't. Come here. Come here. Ashley, I'm going to trank. No, he's, he's just running away now. Come back here, Windwalker. Oh, I can't remember what the command for whistle follow me is. Come over here. I'm not... Fi oh, he's, he's over there now. Right. Just going to leave it alone. He is going to leave it alone. Right, so if I go back this way, is Windwalker going to come follow? He's following Frithgar, it says. But he's out in the water. Does that mean he's not going to, like, is he going to stay stuck in the water or something? Go there, take that down, and I'll take another tree down over here. This, this is the next thing, is whether or not it's going to come back and follow me like I want it to. You're encumbered, drop some weight to move. Come over here, Windwalker. I could really, really do with your help. Right, I need to go to options. I'm going to have to do this every now and then. And right, so whistle, all neutral, all stay, all follow me. J is all follow me. You follow me is T. Okay, I can do that. You follow me. It's not following me. I'm wondering if he's gone and got himself stuck in the water. I shouldn't... I should have disabled it. Um, oh, there we go. Oh, you've got to get close enough for it. Ooh, trilobite. <gasps> Wait, these things give oil, don't they? Yes, they do. Look, oil and chitin and silica pearls and raw meat. Like, loads and loads and loads of really useful things. Uh, right, you come over here a minute. Come here, come here. Stop running away. I got it. There, there's another option. There's, there's, there's another option that we we gotta get. Because he keeps running away. Um, all aggressive. No, uh, you. All passive. I think it's just that one. You stay put. Why? You stay put. And. 
Right, I need, I, I, I need to be able to move. Come back here. Look, he's, look where he's gone. He's, he's gone miles away. Why are you stupid fool? What are you doing that for? I, I need to, I need to unload a load. I need to get, I need to dump some of this. Right, uh, we will. What do I do? Do I drop it? Right. Oh, oh, oh to drop there. One hundred wood. Right, come back. Right, you, you fool. Go to that one. Behavior, and disable change. Uh, passive. Right. Now, I've got bugs here. You killed a Mega Neura. Right. You're going to come back over here now. Or you're going to stop being foolish. So, I've got a Mega Neura right there. Killed another one. Giant insects. Don't you just love this place? That gives me chitin and raw meat. Just just from these insects you get loads. More chitin. More chitin. Loads of it. Right, now. Are you going to stop being utterly redonkulous? I need to transfer that. Silica pearls. We've got oil. Uh, I'll put the meat in there. I'll put the chitin in there. And we'll put in all of that timber. And then you've got some level up. So I'm actually going to go with your carry weight. 499518. Windwalker has leveled up. Fan schmastic. Right, now we can carry back over here. And I need to remember to do that. In future, I've got to make sure that I put them on passive. Before I go <laughs> running up and attacking anything. Or bad stuff will happen. Now what happened to that wood that I dropped out on the ground? Where did I put it? I left timber on the ground. Well, it was... It was only a hundred. And quite frankly, I got lots of those. Right. Let's take that. I don't think it's going to be particularly useful. The leveling up is going to be useful. What I want to do is I want to come over here and... Take a load of timber and a load of timber. There. So this this now is kind of the next big thing that we want to do. Is we want to take uh, get a load of timber like this. Uh, you're encumbered. I'm going to be so encumbered that I can't move. Right, uh, T is follow. Come here. Wait, right, useless. Okay, he's, he's, he's not going to let me do it. Uh, hmm. No, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go with a bit of health right there. And then I'm going to go here and I'm going to dump some stuff on the ground again. Maybe if I just dump 20 you. Right. Is a pa No, I'm going to have to dump some more. Nope. Oh. I see. Decomposes in one minute. Right, that's why. It's because it's so fast. I didn't realise it was so fast. So you've got to be pretty quick. So I'll take you and I'll dump you out as well. And then I can go over to you and I can go like that and we will transfer those Plus the thatch, like that. And then I will turn round and I will pick up and I will pick up. And then I'll go back to you. And I will drop those in there. So you are now carrying 350 out of 580. This, this, this creature right here this is the perfect pack mule, this one is. Absolutely perfect pack mule. That one up there, that's a pack mule. Except that I don't have the, the required anything to be able to take that one just yet, I don't think. Yeah, I might be able to. Probably not, though. I, I don't know how many trank arrows that one would take. Even though I've got, like, I, I've obviously got the settings have been increased by quite a bit. Because I don't think, under normal circumstances, uh, one trank arrow would take down a uh, parasaur. I think you would actually have to use more than that. Uh, let me go here, so I will put all of that timber in there. So you've now got 485. Let's go and get a little bit more. I've got another level up. I go to there, and let's go and level up. So that puts us on 200 health. We've got 80 engram points at the moment, and we're level 31. It's definitely slowing down the rate at which we're leveling up. And you can see here, a lot of this stuff here, 
Um, oh, there's, that's like the last of the stone. Oh, no, that's metal stuff there. Yeah, it starts unlocking all the metal base. So st stone base is what I want to start with. I want to be able to make like a full stone base, ideally. So we will unlock all of that. The hide pants and stuff, I guess we're going to have to work our way through those as well. Uh, wooden spike. Do we want spike walls? I don't think we want spike walls at the moment. Now, stone wall. I got bug repellent there, which we could go for. Uh, we got the stimulant. We've got a parasaur saddle, carbonimus saddle. Not going to get... I well, actually, you know, maybe a parasaur saddle would be a useful thing. Because they, they do run along fairly quickly, don't they? That might be a good idea. All right, let's 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 go for a parasaur saddle. We'll see about making one of them. It'd be nice to be able to have a dinosaur to ride around on as well. And then what was I looking at? Right, I got a dinosaur gate there. And the dinosaur gateway we've already unlocked. I'm not going to worry about a preserving bin. What about that? The forge. Now, that's how that we will need that to be able to make some metal and stuff. So take you and the smithy as well. We're going to want that. Those are both items that we're going to actually find really useful. Tripwire alarm. Pole mono scorpion. Oh, that's like the scorpion. Scorpion things. Those look so wickedly cool. I definitely want to be making some of them. At some point. At some point. Uh, now, stone wall, stone foundation, stone ceiling, stone door frame. Various stone items. Capturing those and being able to fly them as well. That is another thing that we will do reasonably soon, but not quite yet. Uh, let's have a look in here now with the crafting and see what the saddles are. So we've got... Um, well, at the moment, I think it just does it in order, doesn't it? There. So you right there, I need I need 80 fibers. Let's, actually, I've got the materials to do that. So let's have a look at you. I can level you up again. Movement speed, I can increase that. I can go for extra carry weight, or I can go for health. You are going to be carry weight. We'll go with that. And I want to take fiber away from you, like that. And then I want to go to crafting, and I want to make that one right there, which is the parasaur saddle. Make that one. And as soon as that is ready, we can use it, and we can equip the saddle on Windwalker right here. And we'll be able to ride her all the way back. Uh, yeah, female. Primitive. And unfortunately, folks, I'm going to have to interrupt things here. I think we could do the little break. The dinosaurs, they can be a bit much sometimes. So if you've enjoyed the episode, then please head down below and give us a like. And if you really enjoyed it, then please tell your friends all about me. Get them to come and watch as well. That would be awesome. And until next time... Thank you very much for watching. This is Frithgar. Goodbye and see you later.